Hello, you magnificent people of the YouTube nation. I'm here in order to tell you about my latest masterpiece. I poured so much sweat and vodka over this. Oh, you would believe how many vodka that I've had with only me and my friend. Unfortunately, you cannot see him, but he been worthy companion during all of game design. Either way, we will play this game about murdering many innocent people called Bloodline Russia. And this game is forbidden for sensual people, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to try harder. You will have to seduce me for a very long time if you want to be able to play the game and be able to listen to everything that I have to say. So, just in the likelihood that you never heard of me, my name is Baker. 7498 And here we have Bloodbat Kafkas Now you see I've titled the game Kafkas because it sounds just like Kefka of Final Fantasy 6 A very popular tale of violence and murder amongst the Russian nation So this is a game that was intended for Russian audience, as you can tell by this. Now, it is the way I wanted people to enjoy my masterpiece. But considering that there's cold-blooded Americans that supposedly want a piece of the action, you can play in English. Now, that smart game design. And in fact, we thought about everybody. You can be Francais, Dutch, Hispana, Polski, Gibberish, and Italiano and Roman. We satisfy all of the sphere in Europe and America and probably even Africa. Just give us some more time and they will be able to enjoy Bloodbath Kafkas like the rest of the sheep over. In a way, this was a take on a game out there. It was called Tetris. But we decided that it needed psychedelic substances as well as murders. And this is what we've got. So, yeah, we have to select the complexity. Now you see, difficulty is too much of a very thin term, so I figured complexity is something that will satisfy the puzzle fan demographic. Very believable audience. I mean, it worked for Bad Rats developer, so it will work again for us. Now, we will play normal and disregard whenever the game dies like this. It's because your computer sucks too much. Ho 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 ho. Go back to baby America in order to drink your vodka, Russian Taylor. Anyway, we will start the game. Now, very deep cutscenes in this game. It is represented by the sound of vinyl. Dagestan technology. That's my other birthplace. I'm born many different places. I'm born either in France, I'm born either in America, or I can be brought all the way up to Canada in the igloos of the west. Very believable place. I've been there many times. We could talk about this while I talk about my good friend, Klubuzuzbuzki, a very skilled composer. He made most of the music in this game, just like I can do music too. Unfortunately, I do not have music instruments with me right now, so 
I will just blow in this bottle. Okay, now you see, with the powers of editing, I will show to you my musical abilities. Man, I am so good at this. And this will set the stage nicely for Bloodbat Kafka. And if you spell it backwards, you end up with Saft Wagoo. What sense does it make? You will see as we play the game. Also, we totally did not rip this mouse cursor from Civilization. And yeah, we said that the game is English, but come on, we also need to, to stay true to our Russian audience. They will be the one that will be able to play the game. And we do not use WASD in order to move, but sad. Definitely the best thing. Anyway, very nice man here. He just wants to take a fingerprint on clothing. Yes, either way you can see that there was much good attempts at humor in this game. I wrote all the dialogue myself after drinking for many nights. Now, who knows what this person is doing here, he's just stretching, and right down here you can see the biggest fan in the entire game. Also, this game's so international that my accent sometimes reverts to French all of a sudden, I apologize. Either way, very bleeding man. I am bleeding too, but thankfully, we have swift cleaners over here in toilet because otherwise how would you clean the place? And look, this is a portrait of me. They managed to digitize me so well for the game. I'm so glad of the great work that has been done. So yeah, we have to skip the dialogue and yeah, this dead person is the postman. Don't fuck around with me, said the Terminator in American Housewives, the movie. But why will we be seen in hell, you bastard? And no, we have to stare at the very shiny grenade at the tiny explosion. Because you see, it is part of the tension of the game. My abilities in storyline writing will go down forever as being the best in the industry. Also, for the beginning of this game, I took lessons from Max Payne. Because you see, it was very fun when you were walking in the blood. Very difficult thing it was, but it was so poignant. But yeah. This section of the game right here is a very good symbolism of Russia because it's as difficult to leave Russia than it is to leave this corner. Don't fuck with us. Oh, it looks like the postman is dead. What is going on over here? I suppose there's only one way to go, but forward. Oh look, so many pretty lights, but they cannot quite reach me, so I'm not sure what their purpose is. So yeah, her name is Shamil Rakamov, and that is indeed my real name. Also, hello, radiation symbol, we embrace all future of nuclear devices. Yes, I am a bold man who has such a white wig. I am very delightful bearded fellow, just as generous as Santa Claus. No, I will not cut. Okay, I'm not sure what happened here because this was part that diverted from the script. But what you will see from now on, all written by me. Now, we're in America land, where everybody can read. 
Oh, somebody is very happy to see me. I always dreaded the day that a random postman would be in my apartment. Sorry for such appointment. Oh, look at my grammar skill. So good. Ho ho ho. You know what I am, right? That's right. I am the president. And now I will order you to take my groceries. But why will the president be involved in this tale of violence, lust, sexiness, and scary little leaves? Well, we have to click in order to see more. It doesn't matter, but it matters. You can see, Putin does not fuck around. Hell, have you tried talking to a Putin? They never work out the way you expect them to. Ho oh, ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho! Nothing matters! Just like my favorite band Metallica! And nothing else matters! Also, I wanted to put in Let's Play in the dialogue, but co-worker decided otherwise. Very sad. Very sad that it had to come this way. Artistic vision ruined. The job is not easy, but a job is never easy. I mean, you can either choose to go along with the flow, or you can just be a merry old little man who will forever roam in the big society. It is a well-organized fanatic sect, just like our development studio. Ho ho ho. They are thirsty for blood and they're not shopping. Oh, you mean stopping. And yeah, Jafar, because you know, Aladdin, favorite movie of mine. He is a god. Forget about blue guy. After all, he died harder than a big sofa in a dump. Yes, I believe this has made enough sense. You need to not understand because the president is never your enemy. He saves everyone lives, whether it is by boxing or by simply jumping up and down winning boxing contests and punching a moose in the face. Now, I will control you. Remote control. Now, it is time for you to do my bidding. Kill him. Kill them all. I know you like to kill. Your time is until the dawn. If you refuse to fail, you are dead. Dead like this phone! Oh! I left the crate with Edward on the left. Take them. This is a gift. Welcome to Moscow. Now it is time. It is time to disturb somebody who's speaking. Oh, time is passing on really fast. No, we're in the FBI now. What is this bullshit? Now, this friendly fellow here is my uncle who accepted to pause for the game. As for the bear mask, I've been inspired by a very well-known game called Magic the Gathering. You see, there was a con named Grizzly Bear. Very socialistic con. The bears are together, and they knock all the little goblins down a peg. And no, I never forget how to use a gun. It is part of my natural training. We will knock the shit out of the door. Oh, or maybe not. Who needs training? I am a ghost who goes right through all because I am rushing somebody. 
I may have written this story, but I do not remember a thing. Now doors can be broken with both melee and range weapon. I suppose you know how to use a crowbar. In fact, I do not know. How do I use this? I have no clue. Now, what? Oh, I must go check out the controls. See? Very well detailed controls. It is how everything is done. See? You just press everything on the mouse in order to drop. Ah! in theater anymore. Well, now you see. Oh, forgive my buffoonery. This game made me very happy person. It's so happy to live your dreams. Like a dreamer who just bought some potato chips at a store. In a way, this is the animation for the chroma. Very self-explanatory. Let's take some moment to think about this. We destroy things so much that we destroyed the entire world. An earthquake of might will wash all over you. Oh! Sorry, so enthusiastic. And yes, very wise wisdom that my father told me back when I was a wee lad. I was gonna go play curling, but when he saw that I was losing, he told me, Remember son, you will never win a sword fight with a curling ball. You need to buy Kashlemikov or an AK-47 in order to be able to succeed. Now, this gun here has six bullets. And yes, Allah is the person I like the most. The Red Barrel. That's also my nickname at school. But yeah, I'm not entirely sure what it is, but... But, you see, I just wanted everybody to see that you are a big badass for being a Russian. You can withstand all the bullets. And yeah, very funny decapitated head. What do you have to say for this, Mr. Bear? Very good. So you have to be careful. You can kill everything with everything. That's the lesson of the day. And now time to wake up. It's time to face reality the way I see it. In Hostel number 31. Oh, thank you, Putin, for being alongside with me on this brother. I didn't know that you were from the FBI. But now we have to find Jaffa with our 228 hats. That's how many numbers I know in the alphabet, by the way. So now, it's time for my favorite part of the game, the one where you kill everything. You see, Bloodbath Kafka's just showcases the concept that whenever you are in a firefight, you will lose your cool and your wit. This is why little babies panicking. Just like a grandmother who has just seen a baby boy fall downstairs. Also, sometimes people like to destroy a whole lot. They like to blow up because they're full of dirty explosives. This is why we need to exact a bloodbath of consequences. As well as eat tacos and video. This is the way that the blood path will work. You are not the person who dictates the turn. I am the one that will choose how to walk into the corner of the street like that. It's very hard, game. After all, we wanted to showcase what happens when you simply let the entire 
world gone crazy and just want everything to stop. Now this is a walkthrough for level one. You see, very difficult look. Because you see, there's lots of enemies. So my ideal strategy is to take a ball and then just shoot until people die. That's always been one of my rules. And yeah, be careful of the people that wear sausages. They're the ones that will cause you the most stress. Because they are so dead in power. As for, as for you being not able to see them properly, it is part of the challenge. Oh, and also, this is my favorite. It is something that I really enjoyed for the past months of the YouTube. Also, very innovative feature. We are the first studio to ever do that. No doubt about it. We have the time of the bullets. And this is how things are done. Give me the video cassette, Piglet. And it seems as if we finished the level. Well now, we've done a lot of progress today. Now, I've drawn this continuous screen very well. And yeah, you always get the same score. But remember, beggars are not choosers. So we're going to Vine Vodka. Or maybe I just wanted to say Fine Vodka. Man, very nice looking place. Reminds me of my tender youth. Also, a door is very tricky. Please do not mind the door. Oh, look who's shown up! It's my cousin! Hello! How are you doing? I forgot the one day that you were wearing a paper bag or garbage bag on your head, but that's okay. I still love you, brother. How many years have passed? So many. Yes, my dialogue is the best. Remember, sponsored by Opa. I heard gunshots nearby. Do you know what's up? Yes, I've cleaned up. I put all the blood of my enemies in my beard. And this is why I look so lo-fi. And if I were you, I'd shave because you're not wearing head, you're wearing a paper bag on your face. Do you know why I'm here? I'm here in order to release the killer beast from underneath my... My beard! Oh, it's a shame that the game has already been released. Can't patch new dialogue anymore. Oh well. These are tough times. Oh, we need vodka and we need guns. All of the guns. Now you see... We can go through the fridge in order to get guns. You see? Metaphor for the West and the East. Guns is life. And life is also guns. Also, look at this funny little blow doll that I've made here. So very funny. Also, it seems as if that there's many funny things going on into this place. But... Let's test out our accuracy. Man, we so good at this. We can shoot all of them. Yes, with 30 bullets I knocked down 4 people. Very skillful. Oh, can I go on the internet? Oh, I wanna go to the internet, but unfortunately, I cannot walk. Oh! Walking in place is so hard. Ah, look at this piece of fresh air. Do I want a bat or do I want a shotgun? Or do I want big piece of gun? I will need this one gun over here. It is best course of action. But yeah, remember. This is all fictional, and we do not aim to offend in any way. And now you have to do a thing for your brother and sister 
and mother of law and dog. And yes, I know Jafar. He the genie, of course. So anyway, you now see the deep dialogue and time of options. You have to create a get crate in order to be able to process with the rest of the game. Also, you see very innovative gameplay. You have to stash gun in trunk. Nobody will see it this way. Well now, we've done a lot of progress today. That is it for the showcase of my little game. I hope you enjoyed it the way I enjoyed everything that I do. So, please subscribe to our YouTube page, which is somewhere around here. Where it is, who knows. And remember, if you say anything bad about our game, you will just end up like all of the people we've seen so far. Me very good shot at a rifle. And also, you're probably a big idiot. Oh, I've shown them the zinger. Well, it's time for me to say to you, goodbye. But also, I would also like to say to you that this is a massive...